this one's shorter, so I'll come here. What's up, y'all? <laughs> Thank you. We have a question over here for starting. Oh, where are we at? Kelly, I can't hear. Kelly, oh, over here. Um, this was your first performance in the Grammys. This was Paul McCartney's first performance in the Grammys. But unlike, was it? It was, but unlike that's Paul, odd. But unlike Paul McCartney, you're going home with two Grammys. How does that feel? Like something's wrong? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't know. Um, I didn't know it was his first performance. That's odd. You'd, you'd think that some of that talent would have been on the show all, all lot. So, um, I don't know. I've had a very blessed evening. I have no idea how this happened, but I'm happy I'm taking this home. So, um, I don't know. I'm just very happy that I. My big win tonight. I didn't. It, I didn't even expect to win. My big win was performing. So being able to perform in front of people like Paul McCartney and Bonnie Raitt and Bruce Springsteen and all these people that I admire, you know, um, it, it was amazing. So. Oh no! You know what? I didn't think my dad either. I didn't think any other one of my dads either. I forgot. You forget, especially the first time I was bawling. So no, I didn't think so many people. I'm gonna have. I know I have like 30 things my BlackBerry yelling at me, but yeah, sorry. Oh, man. Well, the first time, um, I literally was shaking so badly, I just couldn't stop crying. Um, it's just, you know, your 12-year-old self is, is kicking yourself right now going, what in the hell is going on? <laughs> so, you know, you're, it, I, don't, I was just so excited. And I literally, like, what I was thinking is I want to talk to my mom, and I'm so going to start crying again. Sorry. <laughs> but, um, you know, I'm just really excited. So. What, what were you? I know, and I'm still crying. I know. I I know, I know. I'm just so excited. You don't think it's ever going to happen to you, so yeah. I just see the people. I was against a beetle for crying out. I had no chance in hell. I don't know how this happened. Yeah, the song, um, the song that I performed because of you. I wrote when I was 16, and what's funny is um, the girl I came with tonight, one of my friends, Ashley. Um, I called her right when I wrote it, and um, I was like, dude, I know this is the song I'm going to perform on the Grammys, and I must have a straight line to God, because it ended up happening. And, um, you know, that just kind of catches up with you on stage, and you get caught up with it. And I'm a girl, so I'm emotional. So, <laughs> Kelly Clarkson, Human Newman from Sirius. Hi. Oh, hi. There you are. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, do you feel good? And um, what's next for you? Movies? Uh, more music? What do you want? How far do you want to take your career? Um, you know what? I just want to keep making great music. I looked down the audience tonight and I saw all these phenomenal artists that are just legends. And I would love, I would aspire to be that one day. Um, you know, and just keep learning and growing musically. Obviously, the first record is completely different from the second one. And the third one we're working on now is completely different as well. You know, it's a little more rock. And I don't know. I just, my whole thing is just to continue to grow as a person and artist and just to write music for me and not to make number ones, you know? I don't want to get stuck in that slot of trying to be a formula. So, um, I don't know. I, you know. Wherever God takes me is, is where I'm, I'm happy to be, so. Oh my God, like 40 million people watch that show. If they're not, they're TiVoing it. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know. Well, there's a lot of us here tonight, actually, so I don't know. We have I don't two know. more questions. Oh, oh, and it doesn't, I mean, oh, this is, I mean, I love Idol, and I love that that was my door to come in, but I, like I said, like, I used to watch this show, like, every year. It was like a family thing. We had one television, and I'd be like, this is my night, and y'all are all watching the Grammys, whether you like it or not, and I'd sit there and watch it, and then go perform in my room with a hairbrush on the commercial breaks and come back, and it literally is just like, I, I don't know, my 10-year-old self is just loving it right now. So, And I keep crying. <laughs> Kelly, Kelly, for, for Mexico, more, Kelly, uh, for, how do you feel, uh, how, Kelly, for Mexico, would you like to say something to your fans, your Mexican fans? Yeah, we're, we're going to go tour there. We're, we're probably going to start with the next record, though, because it was kind of late in the game to go there now, because the only place we have left right now is we're fixing to go tour Europe because the record just blew up there. And so we're going over there, and then we're um, already working on the third album. And so we're coming to tour Mexico. That's actually one of our big things on our agenda for the next record. What did you have a question? <laughs> Um, uh, what does this do for my love life? Oh Lord, honey, this is, this is not good for your love life. <laughs> it's just hard enough dating. And then when you're this busy and in the public eye, it's that much worse. But luckily I'm 23 and I have all the years ahead of me, so I'm not worried about it, but that's good. everything. Thank you very much, everyone. I, I can't hear you. What? 
I'm myself. I'm much harder on myself than anyone is. And that's one reason why Simon was never even mean to me. Yeah, he, he knows that I'm my biggest critic. And um, I just think you can always be better. doesn't matter what you do. I just think it could always be better and you can always learn. So, But thank you so much. Thank you much. very much, Kelly. Thank you. Congratulations.